we have some quite interesting Patreon exclusive footage for the video I did about the mass behind the stage production, the curious incident of the dog in the night time because between filming the YouTube footage and putting on the live version for school students where I showed them all the masks that I put in the video pretty much. Bunny, the set designer who designed the set, actually found her original model. And so I got to use her model of the set on the set when I was talking about the masks of it. And even though I couldn't put it in the YouTube video, it was too late. Over the course of the week I spent with the model, I went a little bit ridiculous, you could say. And during the show, I had a camera on the stage so the students could see the model up on the screen that was behind it. And for the very last performance, I just happened to hit record. And so the footage you're about to see is not meant to be viewed as a video in isolation. It's just the live camera feed from the stage. But I thought you might like to see what I did with a set on a set. You've got to check that everything works like in great detail which is why they build a model first so this is the actual model of this set before the set was built and i've got a camera here which i'm going to can we fade that in here we go right so if i point look at that right so there that is the model of so there's the set there's there's the actual set that i'm on right now and then there is the model of the set and so bunny had to build this first to make sure that everything would move, a door wouldn't hit something when something else is moving. It, it, and this is exact 1 25th scale. And it's not even just the set. So let's say if I put a chair over here, so I'm going to put a chair at negative 4C. And so you can see, right, so over there on, on the actual set there is now a chair at negative 4C. And so you're like, well hang on, we need to have, here we go, a chair at that. How good is that? Negative 4 C. And actually if I get one of these prime number blocks and put that two lines down in here, I can get one of these and put it to... How good is... The rest of the show is just me putting things here and then putting smaller versions there. Although, the doubt... Three of you very excited about that prospect. Uh, but the reason of you, the reason the rest of you did not applaud is you're thinking, well, hang on, Matt. You've got a set with a model of the set on the set. Surely there should be a model of the model of the set on the model of the set that's on the set. So, of course, I made one of those. There we go. <laughs> so good. Hang on, wait, 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 wait. If I zoom in to... Okay, so there, that's the, that's the mo- Well, now, hang on, well. No. You need a tiny, tiny chair. I need a tiny, tiny stool. And in theory, I should have a tiny, tiny model of the model of the model. So I made one of those. <laughs> hang on, hang on, it's really small. I've lost it. I've got it, I've got it, I've got it. Hang on, here we go. So if I pop that in place, oh, I've squashed it. <laughs> here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, it's upside down. Hang on. We're not doing the rest of the show until I get this in position. Yes! So now, look at that! Right, so, if I can, okay, so there, that is a model of the set, on the model of the set of the model of the actual set that we're on. And so, um, and the, the next one down, oh, the next one, no, I haven't made it, it's ridiculous. Right, and so, I love the fact though, that you can't just be like, oh, I want to design a thing. You've got to actually do it in excruciating detail at scale. And I was lucky enough to meet Bunny, who was the designer who did all of this, and have a chat with her about how she went about designing this. And so I can bring up, one thing I was very curious about is which, now that you are working with the which bits of mass can you use? So there you are, that was the live feed from the show. The sounds you heard in the background were about 600 teenagers enjoying learning maths. Over the course of the run we had 4,000 students 
come through, which was a huge amount of fun. And even though the YouTube video I did on this was funded by the Further Mass Support Program, without your support, I just I couldn't be doing any of this stuff. So thank you so much, everyone who supports me on Patreon, as well as the Patreon-specific videos that go on my main YouTube channel. Everything I do, all the rest of it, is still partially thanks to you guys. So I really appreciate the everything you give me. And at this time of year, those of you who are on the right level should have got your physical Christmas cards from me and the digital ones are either already out or you'll get them shortly.